A local school district is in the spotlight right now for deciding to relax mask rules during the pandemic. Blanchester Public Schools District voted last night to go against the state's mandate. WCPO 9 News reporter Courtney Francisco breaks down the new policy. Three phases at Blanchester Public Schools before students are vaccinated has the teachers union asking questions. Why this? Why now? Uh, why not continue to follow the state and the CDC and the medical community's clear guidance? Currently, the state requires students to wear masks in and outside at school, but Monday night, Blanchester's school board voted to disregard that, immediately allowing students and staff to remove facial coverings outside and on buses with an open window. In June, no mask required indoors either. It seems blatantly illegal, uh, but it's also just poor judgment. Um, you know, there is still significant spread of COVID. Superintendent Dean Lynch warned the board this would happen before the vote. In a letter he advised in part, unions could accuse the district of providing an unsafe environment. The insurance carrier may not cover lawsuits. He wrote, the state does not permit boards to violate the Ohio Department of Health's order on facial coverings. He declined to talk on camera Tuesday, but board member Jeremy Kaler video chatted with me about his decision to go against that. What we've been hearing is that people are fed up. They're, they're sick of the mask policy. We've had some people who have expressed concerns um, about their child's health over the mask policy. Um, parents that want their kids in school, but uh, don't want them to be forced to wear masks. Every parent or grandparent we asked agreed. I never really agreed with wearing the mask in the first place. Mm -hmm. uh, I don't live in fear. Let go, let God. You know, they're always constantly thinking about that mask on their face, pushing it down. And, you know, they're pulling on it all the time. So what good is it doing? But the teachers union says it's irresponsible. What problem are they trying to solve here? Uh, we know that masks have worked to contain the spread of the virus throughout the year. Uh, we are getting closer to the end of the school year. This will be an opportunity to kind of reassess the situation locally and statewide. Reporting in Blanchester, Courtney Francisco, WCPO 9 News. Now, the one member who voted no uh, against this policy change, Kathy Gephardt, declined to talk on camera. She told us, though, she'd prefer to follow the medical community's lead to mask use.